Hello, everybody, and welcome to my lecture on It's Not Rocket Science. So, I got a phone call yesterday from one of my clients, and she was like, Christy, why doesn't people understand that it's not rocket science and this isn't that hard? And I'm like, well, um, because you've listened to everything I've told you to do. No, so so on a serious note, um, yes, it does help to have professional guidance like she has, um, which would be me. However, um, I'm here to tell you that I think a lot of hype out there goes with nutrition. It goes along with people making it more difficult than it needs to be, trainers making it more difficult than it needs to be, nutritionists making it more difficult than it needs to be, anyone out there making it more difficult than it needs to be, really. Um, I will tell you, I cook for my family about three to four times a night um, because I live in the middle of nowhere um, and I don't have anywhere else to eat out. So, but anyways, um, I cook a lot and I cook for my family. I eat what my family eats because I want them to have the healthy nutrition that I have. So at Twin Fitness, we believe in insulin controlled nutrition. And what does that mean? That, that may, mean, may not make sense to m many of you out there. But what that means is you have to eat, so break it down. There, I've told you this before, there's three, three categories that your, your food falls in. It's either a fat, a protein, or a carbohydrate, and it can be a mixture of a couple. And I've told you before, there's only five items that I believe in that are truly just got protein in them and nothing else. Um, and I'll recap that real quick. It's um, meat, like a red meat, a fish, quality protein, like twin fitness protein, a quality protein source is also has zero, if not little carbohydrates in it. Um, chicken, um, poultry, chicken, and or um, eggs. Those are about the only items that truly just have um, protein in them. So you need a protein source and a fat source at every meal, period. That's all you can focus on. Because I guarantee you, you are going to be con consume carbohydrates. You don't have to try to consume carbohydrates. Car carbohydrates are everywhere, boys and girls. Like everywhere you turn, everything has carbohydrates in them. Even vegetables, even even awesome fruits and, and things that we all love. So I'm here to tell you it's not rocket science. You have to eat a protein and a fat at every time you eat. That includes snacks. That includes um, on-the-go snacks. That includes breakfast. That includes whatever. Um, and those fat sources can be simple. They can be butter added to your vegetables. They can be nuts um, added to your apple that you like because I'm an apple person. I think I've told you that before. Um, they can be really, really simple things that you need to do. Um, and if you change your nutrition and exercise a little bit, you don't have to spend hours and hours in the gym. Um, it does work and it works really well. Um, we have produced, we're on our fourth cookbook now. I think this is, yeah, this is volume three. Um, we're working on our fourth one right now to, to, um, have out there. And we do this because every time I meet with a client, I'm like, if anything in this cookbook is fair game, you can cook out of it. You can eat it for lunch. Um, it's real food made for real people in the real world. So I think that's important to convey as well because I hear about all these systems that everyone does, and I think my brother-in-law is doing one right now that he has to eat all these prepackaged meals, and it works for him, but what I don't like about that is not teaching you truly how to eat, and I know it's the easy way out, but come on, guys, we don't live in the easy world anymore. We've got to put some effort. You have to put effort into your nutrition. You can't just exercise, and like exercise, you can exercise for an hour and then forget about it. Nutrition is a 27, 24 hour, seven day a week job. You can't not eat. Um, and I I actually really enjoy food. Um, I enjoy cooking with different types of food. Um, I enjoy cooking, period. So you have to think about it as, as a simple way of life. You have to eat a protein source and a fat source at every meal. Everything else, I promise you, will come into play and it will be easy. Um, again, Obviously, by now you know, um, I'm one of the co-owners of Twin Fitness. Um, I'm a nutritionist as well, and I'm trying to really make it easy for everyone out there um, because it's not rocket science. I promise you it's not. I've preached this for many, many years, and if you'll just listen to everything I have to tell you, then we will all be great and live a better life, right? I'm kidding. Um, but if you do need my help um, any more than, than maybe these videos, I can always be reached at twinfitness.com or christyw at twinfitness.com or you can also Facebook me on um, any of my Facebook pages as well. But I'm here to help you. I definitely want to um, teach you a new way of um, healthy, lean, living lifestyle. I think it's really important out there. Um, and it's not rocket science. Like I've said, don't make it more confusing than it has to be. You don't have to give up all your favorite things. I'm a chip girl, for instance. I have a handful of chips probably about every day. 
Um, of course, they're organic and like baked, but they're still crunch for me and I enjoy them. So um, anyways, I will be lecturing, I'm sure, very soon on a different topic um, that whatever comes to mind. So until next time, remember, it's not rocket science and don't make it too complicated. See ya.